Welcome to Rage You Nerds, I'm Mr. Cack. We are going to discuss a trailer, give it a thumbs up or thumbs down. What we ask from you, the audience, is to comment. Letting us know, did we get it right? Did we get it wrong? What do you feel? How do you feel like this trailer is or the movie's gonna be? Let us know in a comment, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date with all of our content. Please hit that notification bell. We call it Smash Smashing the Dingy. dingy. Alright, let's do this. Is pull grind. Let us do. Uh, I can't even read them, or I'd take a guess. Let's go Super Mario Brothers. All right. How can you read that? We'll do Super Mario Brothers, on. and we'll come back fresh for Transformers. All right. So uh, this is this is another Chris Pratt movie. Uh, people have had lots of thoughts about Chris Pratt voicing Super Mario. Let's see how we do with it. All right. Here we go. This isn't a teaser. This is a real thing. Right? Real trailer. Okay. Real deal. Not sure if you know who I am. Jack Black. To rule the world. <laughs> wow. Uh, yay. But there's one <laughs> problem. There's a human has a mustache just like you. Do you think I know every human being with a mustache wearing an identical outfit with a hat with the letter of his first name on it? <laughs> because I don't. <laughs> Bowser is coming. Together, we are going to stop that monster. <laughs> How? Look at us. We're adorable. <laughs> oh, I got this. Fair. No problem. <laughs> There's a huge universe out there with a lot of galaxies. They're all counting on us. No pressure. Hey, Mario Kart! <laughs> oh, yes! Rainbow Road! <laughs> Listen to that epic score of Mario Brothers. Wow. Why are uh, people why are people so pissed about this thing? Because they're people, man. We could we could do a whole show on that. Oh man, it wasn't bad. He he's did not the, Italian. He, he's a he white American. He did, he, did, to play the... he did the little "Let's go, let's go." <laughs> and let's and go. Woo <laughs> <laughs> oh man, people are just people are just upset about this for whatever. All right, no uh, reason. <laughs> well, all right, TJ, you're up, buddy. Reaction. To hell with all those people upset about this. We're getting a <laughs> Mario movie with aspects from the game, actual aspects. From the game, you know the 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 bridges and the collapsing things, and then the, the, from the multiple fireball, games. The, the 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 suit, the the Mario Kart, everything. Like, I, like I I think I said it before when we watched the teaser. You know, I would be happy if this movie ended with Mario like getting to the end or whatever, and then like one of the Toads is being like, "I'm sorry, but the princess is in another castle." <laughs> yeah. You know, I would be happy with that because it set would up set part up. Two. You gotta set up part two. So, oh god, this looks like it's gonna be a hell of a lot of fun. And for people like me, like Jared, who grew up with the original Super Mario Brothers, Super Mario three, let's not count two for I obvious two. reasons. Two was all right, but it was all a dream. But <laughs> you know, Super Mario Four, you know, just Mario Kart for you know people who grew up with that and just <laughs> can see all these references and everything. Like it's gonna be a lot of fun. Jared, 
all I want is them for at some point, and I, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this horribly out of key, but like you know everybody knows the main Super Mario music they played at the end of the trailer there, but like remember in part three when it would go back and you had to go between your your little maze of going to the next level thing, and they was this music yeah I hope they get that in there somewhere that's all I want. That's actually that's not all I want. Um, okay, so I, as far as let's just I'm not even going to single out Chris Pratt. I'm just going to say all voices for something like this, as iconic as it is. I mean, you could put anybody for any voice in that movie, and I am still excited about this. It does help that it's Chris Pratt because I know he can deliver. You know, and this will be well. I say it'll be one of his first time voice acting. I don't know of anything else that he's in. He may have done some some other you know some some stuff, but. <clears throat> um. Yeah, so I th I feel like uh, for me again, it doesn't matter. The voices don't matter. The nostalgia is what gets me. It's kind of like we grew up on this stuff. Like the moment they rolled through Rainbow Road, I was like, ha 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 ha. ha. Like hey, anybody who's ever played Mario Kart and grew up with that, they saw that and they were like, hell yeah. Um, you know, and uh, the thing about this is, I hope they don't get the one thing I want from this is they don't get too. Too, too, too involved. The story's got to be good, but don't get too involved with it. Just let it be Mario and Luigi. And that's, I think, the one thing where, where they try to make these movies from games and, and to get that nostalgia, they dive way, 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 way too deep into a story to where it's not boring, but it's kind of like, all right, you know, it's you could have done better with that. Like, we don't, we don't need to know the Koopa Troopers, mother-in-law's best friend's sister from 1954. Um, and how that <laughs> leads into thing. We got a bad guy. We got a good guy. And let's let's pretend like they're mad at each other uh, or whatever. So, uh, but yeah, for me, 100% love this. You know, honestly, anyone adapting a video game into anything, whether it's fully CGI animated or whether it's a crossover between the CGI animation and the human world, the real world, uh, if you're not following the game plan left by Sonic, I don't know what you're doing. Sonic was awesome. The second Sonic was also great, but the first Sonic was awesome. Uh, and, you know, honestly, I like the second Sonic, too, because it included more Sonic characters. Uh, and I like that this movie's just going to be. Like, we're not, we're not roping in some human that's got a love interest and a family and bullcrap. It's just straight up Mario, Luigi, all the crap in between. Right? I think it's different that Luigi is the damsel in distress for this film. But at the same time, it's Charlie Day. The voice the voice actor for Luigi is Charlie Day. Charlie Day probably will make a very hilarious damsel in distress, right? Uh, it's just going to be an anxiety-filled Luigi getting picked on by Boos and Koopas and Bowser himself. Uh, so I can't wait. Uh, somehow I hope they do like a little nod to Luigi's mansion where he's in just trapped in a house with a bunch of those uh, boo ghosts coming after him. Uh, and then hope maybe maybe that's the setup for the second one, right? Was the, Luigi's not here. He's in a mansion somewhere. And they got to go find him and he's getting attacked by ghosts. Uh, and then they have their Ghostbusters moment. Uh, but yeah, this looks fun. This looks great. They limited the the amount that we hear Chris Pratt's voice because they know that there's a lot of negativity out there but from what we heard listen i get that people wanted the guy that currently voices that has voiced mario for all the video games sure but like the voice for mario and all the video games are basically yahoo wow 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 let's go it's a me uh so like I don't yeah, he's know how a, he's never really formed a paragraph. Yeah, so I don't know how you listen to that and like, well, god dang it, I need to hear that for an hour and a half. Just that. I mean, other than, other than, like the, the alternative was to make Mario essentially a mute that just kind of <laughs> makes some animated noises See? every now and then when he jumps. <laughs> uh, so listen, I just I think people are getting up in arms about silly stuff, but hey, that's what people do on social media is they get up in arms about silly stuff. Um. Uh, but whatever, I, I think this looks fun. All right, TJ, thumbs up, thumbs down. So let's just let's just get to the point. The reason Chris Pratt is Mario is because Chris Pratt is the biggest actor in the world right now, and they want to sell tickets. Yeah, he puts ass. That in being seat. said, everything in this trailer 
was nostalgia. I'm giving it two thumbs up. Yahoo! Jared? I wish you hadn't done that because I was going to go, Yahoo! You can still do it, buddy. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> yeah, two thumbs up for me. Totally. 100%. Um, this, like, you know how me and TJ talk about going to see movies in theaters and how we just don't do it. It has to be epic. It has to be, you know, or, well, okay. It has to be All epic that or plus, it has to be Ghostbusters. Or it has epic. to be, or it has to be Grant going, hey, Dad, can we go watch this in theaters? And then I'm like, all right, all right, all right. Which was fun. Sonic. I saw Sonic in, in theaters. Um, this is one I will go watch in theaters. Um, I'm going to. As a matter of fact, I'm 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 thinking we get charity. I'm thinking like we get a crew together to go watch this one. <laughs> this is gonna be a crew movie. We should cosplay. Oh shit! <laughs> yeah, let's do it. I'll be Bowser. You could be Mario. Charity could be the princess. Why can't Your I? Son can be Toad. You can be the princess. If you want. <laughs> Nothing stopping you, Jared. <laughs> This is you go be that princess. It'll be 2023 when it comes out. You can be the princess. <laughs> All right, great. But yeah, Grant's totally got to be Toad or Yoshi. Grant could be Yoshi. Yeah. Anyways, whole, we'll discuss whole, later. <laughs> there was a whole island of Yoshis on there. Uh, yeah. I, I I will keep the trend. Two thumbs up. Boop, 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 boop. Um, <laughs> I think this is all cool and awesome. I like that he was wearing. Um, the Tanuki suit, where it's like the full on bear with a tail, like the, basically the raccoon suit. Uh, yeah. I love that. Love that. Love that. Peach picked up a flower, got flower power. Uh, all that's great. Love it. A lot of Kongs are included in this. I don't know how I feel about that. I do appreciate, though, that Donkey Kong's in it because that's like the first interaction of Mario, right? Is fighting Donkey Kong to save yeah. the princess. So I, I'm down for I'm down I'm down to clown with all this. So all the thumbs up and everything. Uh, I agree with Jared. This is something that hey, this will be a great movie that I'm gonna go take my daughter and maybe son because Carter, my son, really likes Mario for some reason. Now he was Mario for Halloween. I've got <laughs> him a Mario toy for Christmas, uh, and like he's uh I don't know he's big don't into this. Don't say so that I, too loud. He can hear you, man. Yeah, I know. Just, he might just be bust, on the toilet just, right now. Just, just bust right you. in here. I still need more pee pee, daddy. Uh, but yeah, so I'm excited for this. This looks cute. This looks fun. This will be something I can take my family to. Uh, and while also having the excuse that I just want to watch the Super Mario movie, honestly. Uh, so, yeah. Well, I, I do want to say one more thing. And, of I, and I hope they I hope they don't leave these two things out. The sun that chases you when you turn your back to it. And the ghost that chases you when you turn your back to them. If they can oh. somehow get that in there. I'd love it. And I probably I hope, will love it anyway. I hope there's an underwater thing where you got to swim through and dodge the, you know, the squids and and fish and stuff. I forgot about those. That trailer. Yeah.